directive will be fully enforced. February 2020, authorities announced that an Italian who came into the country tested positive for the novel coronavirus. Suddenly, what used to be a story heard about countries like Italy, Spain, China, as regards COVID-19, became a reality in Nigeria. In a matter of days and weeks, our lives changed. The way we live, move, talk, and everything adjusted to new ways in a bid to combat the pandemic. It became more serious when President Muhammad Buhari issued a lockdown directive in three states. To remain safe, you must wash your hands regularly. We were told you can't come too close to other persons. Proximity became an issue. Our sitting arrangements changed. Our meetings changed. Above all, we are told to wear a face mask. I started li listening to radio commercials consigning this. They will tell you it is not that you have to walk along the road with it. The only thing is that when you see somebody that is having cough, somebody coughing or whatever, you have to use your mask. Wearing a face mask outside of a medical theater wasn't a popular thing to do, save for a few persons who chose that as style like Nigeria's music maestro Lagbaja, America's pop idol Michael Jackson. Today, whether you like it or not, you can't afford the risk of not wearing one. After we are done sewing it, we'll take it through a heating process. We have taken time and procedure to make it in a way that it can actually protect you from either anything coming out of you in case for a person who is already infected or going in for somebody who is not infected. Basically, the mask is supposed to protect. But the unique part of it is that you're expected to take it out and wash it every time you wear it. Not everybody, however, seems to appreciate the dangers of COVID-19 and efforts are tackling it. The disease is either a myth, a government creation, or they just can't be bordered. I don't even get money to eat. Now. As I did, I was hungry, they hungry me. I don't even see money to chop food, talk more of mass. Last, last, like they say in a local parlance, Corona go go. Simply put, in the end, COVID-19 will leave Nigeria. No doubt, slowly but surely, Nigerians are responding to the challenge of the moment. At least you can see that with our fashionable marks of protection. Olu Phillips, Channels Television News.